and I am back with review mail. I didn't have any last week because I only had two items. This week I got inundated with stuff so I have a lot. So go grab yourself a cup of coffee and let's get into this. First thing I'm just going to grab right off the top I got um, I was watching Dawn and Cauliflower and she's got this um, shoe organizer on her door behind her, which I am going to do. She's got all of her extra like um, face, or, uh, skincare stuff and extra makeup items that she doesn't use in there. I'm going to do that. So I got a um, shoe bag, or a over the, over the door shoe organizer. There's 24 pockets in it. And I thought they would be deep enough for sure to put stuff in. So that is my first item. Thank you, Dawn. The next item I got, again, was some microfiber kitchen cloths. And you can never have enough kitchen towels or washcloths or whatever. These are, I'm thinking these are washcloths. Because it does say kitchen cloths. So I have kitchen towels and now I have kitchen cloths. And you can never have enough of that kind of stuff as far as I'm concerned. So... Uh, and one thing I was so tickled to get, you know, I I um, opted in for some brushes, and I did not know that they were going to be real techniques. And I got these for like $7, I think. Because um, they looked like real techniques, and I thought, i got to try this. And they are real techniques. I'm hoping they're real. I really do. Um, these are real techniques, Sam's Picks. High definition results, online tutorials by Sam and Nick Chapman is who Real Techniques is. And the set exclusive it says is this. This must be the, like the, see it says set exclusive there. But it's got, um, looks like the blush brush and the concealer brush. Do they say what they are? No, they just have real techniques on them. Um, there's a lip brush or an eyeliner brush. I'm not sure. Um, this one here I use for my um, highlighter. This one here can be used for like um, setting your concealer. And this is the blush brush, I believe. Like this one. They're different colored, but that's okay. But I'm very excited about this. Very excited. All right. Next. God, I got a lot of stuff. Next, I got... This was off of um, Real um, Review Kick. And I got a 100% spill-proof mug tumbler. And I got it in lime green. And it says, love your mug. And this is what it looks like. This is rubber here. And then you just lift, I believe, you just lift this up and up like that. And then it's got the hole in here. Just shut it down and then it just opens up like this and like that. But that's pretty big. I, I would guess this is 16 ounces. Not microwave safe, which I don't wash my mine. I wouldn't wash mine in the microwave. Oh, I'm going to be cutting that part out. Not microwave safe, which, duh. Okay, so that's that. I got ugh, one of the green earth pan and I am going to open it I wanted to leave it in the box until 
I showed you guys. And it's got this in it, and this here is you put it in there after you when you store it, so it so you can put other pans on top so it does not harm this pan. And this one, and look at the very nice. It's a huge pan, huge, 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 way bigger than my head. That's for darn sure. <laughs> and I have a big head. This is Greblon Ceramic Weilenberger German Technology. And this is, um, get rid of some of the stuff so I can read this. Greblon Ceramic Coating from Germany. No harmful heavy, heavy metals or chemicals. Superior non-stick performance durable scratch resistant ceramic as found in nature. Comfortable silicone handle, completely eco-friendly, ceramic coating emits no harmful fumes, easy to clean, induction stove safe. Elevated texture creates air pockets with distribute heat underneath food to enhance cooking. Patterned cooking service helps prevent food bonding for superior non-stick performance and easy cleaning. It's ultra safe, 100% PTFE and PFOA free ceramic nonstick coating from Germany. And there it shows the the coating on the bottom there. And this here it says Earth Pan. I'm so excited about that. I, I was just I couldn't believe that I got that. Okay, and I got some um, gel pens, which I was ha and these are really different. These are color diamond, 18 colors, um, 0 0.5 millimeters, and it's all this writing is all in Chinese. So they're from, but these are different from any gel pens I have. I have not used them yet. I have not tried them. They're small. I mean, they're they're different. Um, so I can't wait to try them. I will be trying them later. So, um, let's see here. And I know I said I was never going to get it anymore again because I had plenty, but I got some pencils. <laughs> these are from Review Kick, and I got these completely free. So that's why I got them. There's 36 colors in there, and these are also from China. You can see the Chinese writing there, and the little panda guy on there. But there's 36 of them in there. Okay. I got some uh, Footmate Foot Care, Comfort Fresh, Comfortable Anti-Slip, Anti-Shock Foot Insole. Now, my feet have been bothering me. Um, I don't know if these are going to do any good, but I thought I would try them. Um, I have I had bunion surgery many years ago. Um, I had one bunion on my foot from wearing high heels when I was younger. And um, they screwed up the surgery. And now the, the bones that are underneath where your bunions, you know, where you, your instep on the inside of your foot, um, there's two two little round bones there that go like this as you walk, or, you know, that kind of rock back and forth when you walk. They are frozen. So um, I have a huge callus that forms right over that, and it really has been bothering me a lot. Um, so I thought I would get some cushion insoles. So I got these really cheap off of um, review, Amazon Review Trader. And so I thought I would try them and see if they work. I will let you know. Um, I, I got an email, a private email from somebody that asked me to review some brushes. Actually, um, I believe it was Ashley um, Thrifty Chica had given me the link to this lady, the email to this lady, so I emailed her and then she sent me these brushes. And that's what they look like. They also look like Real Techniques brushes. They are, they're no name though, they have no name on them. And she asked me to review them, so I'm, I will be happy to do that. These are, it doesn't say, made in China it says. Um, let's just get one of these out. They all look so similar. 
Okay, so this one here, oh, they're very soft. Very soft. They both look kind of like buffing brushes. Okay, those two. Turn this stuff back up. There's a stippling brush, which um, I really don't get stippling brushes. What do they do? This is one of those um, which I will probably never use. I don't like these um, blush brushes, these slanted blush brushes. I just don't like them. And then I don't care for these either. These are, um, so I will probably give some of these away. But I will definitely, the two first ones I'm going to keep. And I'm going to try those. These three here I'll probably give away. Um, in a giveaway or some, in a future giveaway or something. I'll put them in a box. But I will most definitely try those those first two. Um, and thank you so much, Ashley, if you watch this. I don't even know if you watch my videos, but if you do, um, thank you. And I will review these. Okay, what's next? I got a, um, I have in my living room, I have a big, not a huge window, but a, a big enough window in my living room. And I don't have anything over it, anything covering it. What covers it is they've got these slats, these, um, window treatment, but it's wood, and it's so heavy, so heavy. Um, those great big slats that open, you know, um, kind of like blinds, but they're wooden. So I always keep them up because um, I can't see out of the damn things, and they're so heavy to up and, you know, do up and down, so I have nothing on them. So I just be care very careful at night when I'm walking around, you know, that I don't have a light on or or anything like that. So what I wanted was I wanted a sheer cut curtain to put over that I could just move from side to side. And this is a, a one window panel, 54 by 96, and it's 100% polyester. And what it is, is I'm not going to take it out of here yet, but um, it's got these things on the outside. But I'm going to figure out how, because I don't have a, a rod going across, and I don't want to put any more holes in the wall. So I'm going to figure something out, some way to hang these over that. Um, if you guys have any ideas how to hang these without a rod, let me know. Um, because I want, I do want to hang this over my window. You know, plus it's, it's pretty. It's brown. Um, it's got kind of like weaving in amongst it. And um, I got this off of... Um, Amazon Review Trader, too. See, it's just really sheer. Let's just take this out. Really sheer. You can see that. 